Hello fellow travelers and welcome back to our Biggs Adventure. It's time to do another granny square and this week we're going to do the Crochet Rocks Sunshine Granny Square. I do live in the Sunshine State and we have had some beautiful cold weather, cold for us, and beautiful sunshine so I thought I would try this square. I'll leave a link down below in the description. Enjoy! I'm setting up to crochet and I have my little buddy Cookie Lou with me. She is a four pound Maltese Yorkie cross and she crochets with me pretty much every night. My husband and I are currently finishing up the series Fringe on Amazon Prime. I have my Giardelli chocolate. <laughs> That's the most important crochet accessory in my opinion. I love the candy cane ones. They're so delicious and they only ever have them at Christmas. I'm really cruising along now with this pattern. I have to say that her instructions are amazing and that I think even a beginner could do this pattern. It's super simple. If you can do a double crochet and a single crochet and a half double, you've got this pattern down. Her instructions were awesome. I picked these super sunshiny colors because the sun in Florida has been really shining lately and the breeze has been nice and cool. So it's been perfect winter weather for us here in Florida. I had a really great time with this project, just sitting and watching TV with my husband and cranking out this little granny square. It's so cute. On the arm of the chair, you can spy the sunshine granny square that I did in the teal and aqua colors. That yarn was left over from my niece's scarf that I made for her for Christmas. I'm going to say that this square took me approximately 30 minutes to complete and that was using the tutorial which is about 38 minutes long. Her instructions are awesome. I'm putting the blue round on now and that's where the pattern stops is with the blue round but I did go ahead and put a single crochet of white all the way around the edge because I thought it made the blue really pop. Ducking in with some chocolate. That's a York peppermint patty. And I figure that chocolate is one of the most important crochet accessories, especially when you're just chilling out and watching TV in the evening. There it is, my completed square. Super proud of it. And there they are. I'm giving this pattern a 10 out of 10. Came out super adorable. I can see somebody really smiling when they see this beautiful sunshine with its little golden rays of the sun. It's so cute. And I made another one in just some aqua and um, teal colors. I did put a single crochet border around the edge because I thought it was super cute. The square is absolutely so square. I'm gonna give this pattern legit a 10 out of 10. Great instructions, great easy pattern, worked up like a dream. Thanks for watching and remember, enjoy your journey.